Michelle Obama! Former First Lady Michelle Obama is set to embark on a two-month, 10-city book tour to promote her new memoir. First stop, Chicago, Illinois. Michelle Obama has been all over the city this week, stopping by her old high school, city block, and favorite bookstore before she heads to the United Center to chat with another Chicago icon, Oprah Winfrey, about her new book, Becoming. It's about 27 degrees out here. Why did you decide to come out here and meet Michelle Obama and get your book signed? Well, I didn't know it was going to be 27 degrees. <laughs> I don't think it's that cold. Is that a question? <laughs> <laughs> but it could be 27 below and I still would have come. I just feel like she is such a part of Chicago. Looking at Michelle Obama is like kind of the beacon of feminism. I think that she's one of my idols gotcha. besides Beyonce. <laughs> She's just magical, like just a black girl, magical. After finishing up at the bookstore, Flotus sat down in front of thousands of Chicagoans for the main event, a two-hour chat with Oprah Winfrey about her new book. The conversation covered marriage, parenthood, being the first black first lady, and of course, living in the White House. People ask, do I miss the White House? And it's like, no, I don't miss the house because we took what was important in that house with us, and it is with us. It's family, it's values, it's wow. the friendship. So the house is beautiful, and it's historic, and you know, it was an honor to live there, uh, but the people in it make it what it is. Now that the Chicago portion of the book tour is over, the former floatist heads to Los Angeles to chat with Tracy Ellis Ross, followed by her next stop in Washington, D.C., where she'll sit down with Valerie Jarrett. Becoming is currently the top seller on Amazon and has drawn more pre-orders from Barnes & Noble than any adult book in three years.